What is going on guys? Today, Daco and I are going to be talking about Five Nights at Freddy's 3 because he's found some interesting information and I want to discuss it with you guys. But first, let me shed some backstory in this because many of you won't know what I'm talking about. So if you go to the early beta testing successful announcement on the Steam Greenlight page and you look at the you look at each letter that's posted twice in the same paragraph you'll notice that it spells out my name is springtrap so doc was found information that proves that that is the animatronics name because in the troll that scott made in his other announcement game canceled not really you know you could go to the game draw page you can download it you can play the game but someone decompiled the images there and he found out some crazy stuff there so I'm just going to pull it up now and so Daco right now I'm showing the one where his mouth is open and you can see the inside of animatronic. Yeah, uh, just to note that these pictures were from the main menu of the game when you see uh, the animatronic twitching and these have been captured. So yeah, one of them what uh, Pro just said was that you can actually see its jaw inside of its mouth. And if uh, me and Pro found this fishy, because we've always seen this animatronic have its mouth shut with its uh, really weird teeth, like its mouth's trapped and it's been like sewn together. And uh, as you can see on this picture, its mouth's wide open and you can actually see some of its jaw. Um, and the thing about spring trap, guys, is a lot of people are talking about is that this um, jaw could be. Um, reenacting like a spring trap where um, its jaw just randomly like opens up um, and rips open his mouth and the um, the new owners of Fazbear Fright have thought oh th this jaw is bloody annoying <laughs> that we have to keep repairing it let's uh, call it spring trap because to be honest I don't think um, if this new animatronics has, has been in the past games with I am still here, he's always been here, um, the the owners would call it um, Spring Trap because I don't think kids would like to uh, see an animatronic called Spring Trap, to be, to be honest. Um, so I think we think that the new um, animatronics called Spring Trap made by the owners of the company because of its um, jaw reenacting like a spring trap yeah it's similar to the mango that's what they called it because they had yeah to keep preparing yeah it. exactly yeah like they have their own nicknames for the yep. animatronics and i mean that's what they're officially called in the custom night seven so yeah who knows but now uh, i'm just gonna pull up all three images that shows the mouth open in a different length so for example this first image here where you could kind of see the mouth a bit open but his head is tilting to the left he's twitching and stuff and as you can see in the next image it's progressively getting more open until the final product right here where i mean his mouth is like completely open at a 90 degree angle i mean you can even consider it is it like touching its neck its own body with his mouth i mean it's like completely open yeah I, um, but um, it's been like that before. If you actually look, it's actually got a big gap um, where its neck is. And I think it's just from like erosion and it's been worn. Yeah. Stuff like that. So this endoskeleton is obviously old. Very old. It's brown. I mean, look, in this image, you can see how much color it's lacking. I mean, you can easily see that the green of the of the physical suit itself and then the endoskeleton inside look at that drastic color change yeah look the, the endoskeleton looks really rusty as yeah, well broken doesn't look perfect <laughs> clean all those adjectives and their similarities but now it looks like a slight cyclops in this one <laughs> <laughs> i mean what's that brown stuff at the top left i, I think it's just stuff I don't know way to explain <laughs> it. There's loads of different colors. Yeah. It. So those prongs you see in its mouth, that's the spring trap slowly being open, right? I mean, you know how it's like, chit, chit, chit. Uh, yeah, it, it yeah, clicks, yeah. it keeps clanking, you know, clamping, whatever you want to call it. What we was thinking as well, like with this um, spring trap, is that maybe it is going to be in the actual game. We see him like this, even though when we see the trailers of him coming into our offices, you just see it with um, his normal mouth, maybe some nights um, 
we actually see him like this and maybe it might change the tactics or something maybe oh, that'd be awesome yeah maybe it becomes more deadlier or something and we have to be more you know protected because it maybe there might be a brand new jump scare with this um happening maybe we actually might see him come at us with these um like horrible jaws and we might actually get wrecked by him <laughs> yeah and um here's also an image of the troll game he made the menu of it and this is it decompiled in the fusion click team program that scott uses to develop the game and as you can see here we have demo we have night we have all these things we have load 20, we even have the logo at 2015 scott you know copyrighted lives one version 1.13 so you know many people are thinking that this is actually going to be the main menu of five nights at freddy's three you know maybe a little bit more polished you yeah know, add the text but yeah this would probably be it the, the menu is awesome he I is really twitching like right it is twitching in the yeah twitching so like is normal that's exactly yeah. what happened in Final Fantasy for this two and one as a matter yeah, of fact yeah yeah you see them twitching it's weird as well because um it's just the same as the trail the trailer for five nights of freddy's free we see him twitching all over the place in that um room so it's basically the same <laughs> i mean i'm gonna be honest though i love him i love whatever this thing is i don't care if it's yeah. a girl a guy it just looks amazing and i mean look at that image where its head is tilted you see how there's like a little clamp up there or is that a wire yeah i, mean, I don't know it, it just looks so epic like so destroyed so it's supposed wrecked. to be a horror track yeah so wrecked destroyed rip it looks so rip <laughs> oh man <laughs> It I don't just know. looks weird. It just looks not. It just just looks nothing as it is when we see him in the trailer pictures. Yeah, his eyes look all over the place as well. His eyes just don't look as um, they were from the um, the ones what we've seen before. I mean the eye the um, eye colours do, but like the outside of it, it just doesn't look right to me. <laughs> I don't know. It, it's good. It's different from the animatronics we know. Yeah. That's what we're looking for, uniqueness in each game. Yeah. But yeah, guys, that's all we wanted to share with you guys. We want to share with you guys that even more reason as to why the official name of animatronic may be Springtrap. Uh, so these different versions of how the animatronic model would look in-game because of the twitching. Once you slow it down in the game, you know, you screenshot it. And the Click Team Fusion stuff, you know, maybe it's the main menu. So yeah, that's about it, guys. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.